Beauty in art is often nothing but ugliness subdued. A married couple are well suited when both partners usually feel the need for a quarrel at the same time. Take heed of critics even when they are not fair, resist them even when they are. Truth is always served by great minds, even if they fight it. We spend our time envying people whom we wouldn't wish to be. One kills a man, one is an assassin, one kills millions, one is a conqueror, one kills everybody, one is a god. A few great minds are enough to endow humanity with monstrous power, but a few great hearts are not enough to make us worthy of using it. A man is not old as long as he is seeking something. To reflect is to disturb one's thoughts. In order to remain true to oneself one ought to renounce one's party three times a day. There are moments when very little truth would be enough to shape opinion. One might be hated at extremely low cost. God, that dumping ground of our dreams. I should have no use for a paradise in which I should be deprived of the right to prefer hell. Somebody told me I should put a pebble in my mouth to cure my stuttering. Well, I tried it, and during a scene I swallowed the pebble. That was the end of that. To be an adult is to be alone. Theories pass. The frog remains. Nothing is more admirable than the fortitude with which millionaires tolerate the disadvantages of their wealth. Science has made us gods even before we are worthy of being men. Never feel remorse for what you have thought about your wife, she has thought much worse things about you. The obligation to endure gives us the right to know. Falsity cannot keep an idea from being beautiful, there are certain errors of such ingenuity that one could regret their not ranking among the achievements of the human mind. My pessimism extends to the point of even suspecting the sincerity of the pessimists. To say of men that they are bad is to say they are worse than we think we are, or worse than the ideal man whose image we have built up on the basis of a certain few. Far too often the choices reality proposes are such as to take away one's taste for choosing. We must watch over our modesty in the presence of those who cannot understand its grounds. It is sometimes important for science to know how to forget the things she is surest of. Certain brief sentences are peerless in their ability to give one the feeling that nothing remains to be said. To be adult is to be alone. I still understand a few words in life, but I no longer think they make a sentence.
It takes a very deep-rooted opinion to survive unexpressed. Already at the origin of the species man was equal to what he was destined to become. It is sometimes well for a blatant error to draw attention to over-modest truths. In politics, yesterday's lie is attacked only to flatter today's. I don't judge a regime by the damning criticism of the opposition, but by the ingenuous praise of the partisan. The divine is perhaps that quality in man which permits him to endure the lack of God. I think I am one of those who can manage not to take on a completely different appearance under their own glance. I prefer the honest jargon of reality to the outright lies of books. There are certain moments when we might wish the future were built by men of the past. Nothing leads the scientist so astray as a premature truth. It is not easy to imagine how little interested a scientist usually is in the work of any other, with the possible exception of the teacher who backs him or the student who honors him. The books one has written in the past have two surprises in store, one couldn't write them again, and wouldn't want to. Do not try to understand women, because only women understand women, and they hate each other. It may offend us to hear our own thoughts expressed by others, we are not sure enough of their souls. Greatness, in order to gain recognition, must all too often consent to ape greatness. The nobility of a human being is strictly independent of that of his convictions. To love an idea is to love it a little more than one should. One must credit an hypothesis with all that has had to be discovered in order to demolish it.